a decomposing woman's body was thrown into the water tank on the roof of this building but the residents downstairs didn't notice anything unusual they used the water in the tank to make rice as usual there was a black fingernail in the rice the woman was watching tv and eating at the same time she didn't even notice the dirt in the bowl and ate the black nail in her mouth this girl was washing her clothes but realized that the more she washed them the more they smelled i was brushing her teeth and suddenly felt something strange in her mouth then she pulled a strand of hair out of her mouth she was furious and went to the landlord and put the evidence on the table the landlord refused to admit that there was something wrong with the water instead he suspected that the pipes and nana's house were unclean at night when anna brushed her teeth she felt something in her mouth again and when she took it out it was a small piece of human skin anna was so disgusted that she wretched she went to her next door neighbor to ask about it the man insisted that the water was fine and picked up the glass to drink it the next moment he felt something in his mouth then when he took it out it was a black fingernail everyone thought it was disgusting so they went to the rooftop to check but at that moment the lid of the water tank suddenly opened automatically scaring everyone to run back quickly the man threw a woman's body into the water tank on the roof a few days later the body began to rot and stink the residents downstairs used the water in the tank as usual but unnoticed something wrong with the water and poured a glass to question the landlord looking at the yellowish water the landlord thought there was something wrong too but she didn't want to admit it and drank the whole glass of water and i had to come to the roof alone to check it out as she walked up the stairs the man behind her pushed her into the water tank and a struggled but the men pushed her back into the water. At that moment, the female corpse in the tank suddenly came back to life and dragged the man in. The man was strangled by the corpse and drowned in the tank on a struggle to escape and soon climbed out of the tank. After that, Anna called the police. The police dragged out the bodies of a man and a woman from the tank. The onlookers were disgusted. The landlord remembered the glass of water she had just drunk and felt like vomiting violently. The next second, she fainted, straight away. This story tells us, if there's a water tank on the roof, be sure to lock the door on the rooftop.